My name is Kevin. I am the CEO of KTG Hats. Welcome. I'd like to show you some of our newest felt collection for 2024 and 2025. They've actually just arrived and I haven't seen them either. So this is the one a lot of people are really interested in seeing. Let's check this one out. This is the KTG Galaxy in dark olive, with Sudan trim, size 59. I haven't gotten a good look at it yet. This is a nice box, it's a little, little thicker than the typical uh, ones that we used to see. I like that, they're deeper, stronger, and they have better handles. Notice that also, nice, good box. from Quebec, fresh off the factory line. This, this brushes out. That comes from the little foam ring that I was sitting on. Let's take a look at the binding. If your hat comes, uh, you know, and it's a very soft, it might not have a, a crazy snap. Just do one of these. Bring it down once, let go, and it'll start snapping. And that's like a hatter's trick. This has a great snap, though. Center it. Okay, one thing I did notice about uh, the olive version of the Galaxy is that the, uh, the binding is about as wide as a whippet. It's wider than the sky piece, but it's not as wide as it was on the camel or the, uh, the other colors, the ash gray and the gunmetal. Interesting. Well, it's still a new line. We're still uh, tweaking some of the specs. Sweatband is very, very soft. Uh, they have a variety of sweatbands that I can use. You know, harder ones, thicker ones, brown, black. Uh, th this one is the lightest weight and the softest one. It's like a very, very good leather, like that glove leather, that soft stuff. Uh, on one side it says 100%. Okay, let's see. The other side it says. I'm going to try to work out a line for next uh, next run or two runs ahead of that, one or the other. <coughs> Excuse me. The, uh, these are like embroidered labels. It's, it's basically like a uh, kind of like the type that you, uh, you sew in, but it, it's done with uh, like a sticker back adhesive. Says a sky piece of distinction. 
I was thinking about putting little secret messages under each rung, you know? So each one might say something a little different. A little secret, you know, Easter egg kind of thing. All right, let's leave that out. Beautiful galaxy. It's a nice color, isn't it? I hate to say it, it looks perfect as it is. But, we might have to order a wider binder, and that might be the, the deal there. This hat does look very perfect as it is, though, I have to say. It almost looks like iconic. Side piece is a five inch crown. This is a four and a half inch crown with a teardrop. Let me show you the shape of the crown here. steamed up, it's right out of the box. You use a little steam in the band area there. Everything looks very nice though. This hat might have been our best design. Well, everybody's opinion is different. That's what the guys from the factory said. They said they thought this was hands down the, the best looking thing that we made. Size 60, seven and a half, KTG in New Yorker. It's slightly oversized. Now. 
Mm -hmm. That's a seven. I ordered mostly 59s, my size, but I ordered one or two 60s. so I could uh, go into some retail shops, show them my line. But uh, eventually they'll all be for sale, I think. Uh, I'm gonna definitely keep either the mist or the purple sky piece for myself, maybe both. I think the purple. I've been wearing uh, the green one forever, you know, so instead of being the green hat guy, maybe I'll change to the purple hat guy for a little while. Okay, New York. A quick close-up look at it. Sky piece is a 62. I just tightened it up. I generally do that oversized look. It's like a thing I do a lot. Just tighten it up. Had a kind of an oversized, cool hat store guy thing. This one I might have wanted 59, a little bit more tailored and dressy looking for me. working on custom linings, it takes a while, it's not something you want to just rush. You need to get the right uh, proper artwork and everything before you commit to something like that. Uh, it's expensive, and once you make the, the die for it, you know, the, the printing die, you know, that particular part costs a lot, so you have to be sure that your design is, you know, final. So the other thing, you know, it could raise the price of the hats, like five bucks or something. It's, so I've been putting that off. Okay, let's move on. This one, I don't know what 
boxing in here. The boxing is not. Okay, how to order? Just PayPal me the payments. There it is up there to Quadragon. I just need the model, the color, the size, and your shipping information. Uh, send that to me right in the PayPal app or just email it to me separately. It doesn't matter. Generally, your address is already in PayPal. You could skip that if it's there. Uh, but if it's getting shipped to a different address, you know, give me that different address so I know where to ship it to. Okay, uh, you can send me two payments of one forty-two fifty. One would be due now to reserve your hat, and the second payment is due within about two two months. 
basically uh, any time before your hat is shipped. Generally, we'll figure two, sometimes three months for the whole build time. And that's it. Uh, don't wait till the last minute, otherwise it might delay your shipping. Uh, our hats come in every size, all the way from 55 to 64, a full size eight. They run very true to size. Uh, anybody in the United States, continental US gets free shipping. I'm gonna pay that shipping actually. And uh, also if you're a Quebec, Quebec resident, Quebec city resident, let me know. You will also get free shipping. Anybody else, um, we do ship everywhere in the world. It can get a little expensive going to like, you know, Taiwan was, uh, you know, about 106 bucks for you guys. But um, you figure it's going to be up there. It could be from 75 up to about 105, depending where you live. Uh, but uh, it is indeed free shipping for anybody in the continental U.S. or in Quebec. Hey everybody, thanks so much for watching. This is Kevin. Uh, if you'd like to stay in touch with me and everything I've been doing, please join our new Facebook group called Hats and Guitars. Show your hats. It's a cool place to just show your cool hats, meet nice people, and uh, learn a few things.